Hi everyone, welcome into the channel. Just thought to do a quick stream uh, of Train Simulator 2019 and this is a scenario on the London Faversham line. Today you will be working purely on the high speed section driving from Ebbsfleet or Ebbsfleet to St Pancras and then back to Ebbsfleet. Start by loading passengers here before departing in Stratford. You're due to depart at 13.27. So just let's just get our passengers on board. Make that the uh, priority. We've got a very clear day here. here this is the uh, high speed train that we will be uh, driving, and we are currently sitting at Ebbsfleet. Ebbsfleet. I don't. I don't know how you pronounce that really. Um, station is looking pretty cool. Due to depart in two minutes. Just want to give you guys a bit of an overview of the uh, the station and the platform. I haven't posted any uh, of these high speed uh, trains, and um, but I just thought that the uh, the channel would benefit from it. So this is the uh, southeastern high speed uh, train. It's part of the. Uh, London Faversham route and we are on a very clear day today sky's looking pretty cool just literally waiting to depart and we're going to crack on to St Pancras you're ready to make your way to Stratford okay let's crack on <coughs> excuse me Bit of a cough. Here we go. We'll just get speed up a little bit. So I'm using the uh, I'm using the Xbox controller here to control my speed. We need the light on. Let's get reading light on. Thank you very much. It's a bit better. Get a speed. We've got train above us and all. We've got trains everywhere. Yeah, I tried recording this before, um, but the weather was absolutely awful on it, and a lot of it was filmed in the uh, in the dark. <laughs> it's because we, we were travelling at night, so it was a bit of a nightmare. So I thought, well, oh, let's just uh, let's just restart it. We'll do a daytime one. Where uh, it's the weather's at least it's clear, and we can see where we're going, <laughs> which is always a benefit. So just carefully watching our speed, and we're currently travelling downhill. Let's get a bit of a, uh, a different view. There you go. As we go into the tunnel. Of the horn. So hopefully this will be better because we can actually see where we're going this time. Oh, we've got 140 limit now, so let's just get our speed right up. Where is our next? So Stratford International Platform 2 arrive 1339. So what are we now? So 10 minutes away. Depart 1340. So we've got Really, we need to depart properly on time here, so let's crack on and see if we can actually um, get there a little bit before. So, we've got an ETA of 13.39 and it's currently 13.29 some time. So it's quite tricky to actually end up at the platform exactly on time, I think. Just coming out. 
passing another high speed train. You're getting a really good view now. Get a proper view now. Let me zoom out a little bit. Hundred and ten mile an hour. Great view of the train from above. Do one more. So just keeping an eye out. Got another, ooh, we got another eight minutes, seven minutes. <coughs> Excuse me. Oh, just over speed a little bit. Just bring it down. There we go. Pretty good for time. So see how fast this goes by. Wow. I'd say that's pretty fast. This was one of the original routes that I actually bought, but I've not recorded it at any point. I thought it'd be pretty cool just to do this run into St Pancras. Got a nice uh, windmill there. flying through these tunnels. Wait for the uh, station to appear. Such huge tunnels on this route, really huge tunnels.
keep thinking I see light at the end of the tunnel. <laughs> Still doing 120. You can see the flash of the electricity on the cables <laughs> or on the rail. Still no sign of the station. Another four minutes, actually. Well, four minutes, six, seven, eight, about two and a half. Just start reducing our speed right down now it's flashing 80 as we're coming into Stratford Stratford International. I don't know if you can see the, uh, you can see the shadows in the cab. We've got another high-speed train. Where's that parked? Is that ahead of us? Just pulling into the station now. Awesome. It does look really good. Train's coming in on the other platform now. bit of a view from up here. That's our train. That's a long old train. <laughs> Okay, next stop. We're actually leaving a little bit early. I think we're meant to depart 1340, but we're a little bit ahead now. So <laughs> I don't know what that's going to say. may have departed a little bit prematurely. No? Cool. So we are heading straight into St Pancras now. So let's just get our speed up.
do love this uh, cab. It looks so cool. It's really well modelled. Now that I've managed to get a train sim working at this resolution, it's just running like a dream. I have to say though, um, I can actually get it running at even higher resolution this smoothly, but I cannot re seem to record it um, at such a high resolution. So I've had to downsize it a little bit um, to enable it to record smoothly like this for you guys. Okay, we've got uh, St. Pran St Pancras St Pancras International Platform 13 is 4 miles away and we are currently on an ETA of 1.45 and it's currently 1.41 <coughs> So we'll pull this uh, into the station St Pancras. Just wanted to do this little short run and we'll upload it to the channel. I'm planning on uploading as many different routes and trains as I possibly can. So uh, I do like this high speed train. I thought it would be worth just uh, recording. And we're flying along here at some pace. Again, just using the uh, Xbox controller that I have here. Using my new keyboard too, which is a Logitech C2 213. It is. It's, an, it's a Prodigy RGB keyboard, which I'm really pleased with. speed here. Let's bring the speed right down. It comes down to 40 and then down to 25. We've got control upline St Pancras. Just bring our speed right down as we come into uh, the station. Currently about what 35 miles an hour. Green signal. We're coming out into St Pancras. Back out into the daylight. Just gradually bringing that speed down a little bit. You can see what is that? Freight logistics. Let's just get the speed down to twenty five. Want to be speeding coming in at St Pancras. What an awesome view! Just try and get a little bit of an outside view so you can see. There's the water. The train coming straight into. Platform. So I think this is platform 13, I think it is. Just slowly coming in, but watch your speed. I think we've done okay for time actually. Let's just bring it in now. There we go, just slowly coming in. And just take it to the end. 
much as I can. Just carefully trying to <laughs> watch my speed. Okay, there we go. We're coming in now. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to St Pancras. And there we have it, St Pancras. Glorious looking station. You can see there. Just drop below there. Look. Oh, you can see all the shops. <laughs> okay. Just get a little bit of a uh, view from the platform. Everybody coming off, all the passengers neatly in a <laughs> in the line. You can just walk quickly to the end. Just get a view back into the station. There we go. There's our two uh, two high speed trains. Well, just a short upload, and I uh, hope you enjoyed it. Just a quick uh, trip on the London Fa Faversham line. Uh, hope you enjoyed that, and uh, catch you on the next one.